how much is this to blame on the on the referee's performance tonight? Can you repeat the question again? Sorry. Yeah, like another uh, result that you wanted, but how much is the refer responsibility of tonight's result? There was really a lot of questionable calls tonight. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I think at the end of the day, I mean, the result is on us. I mean, personally, the feeling was we, we felt like the ref didn't have his best game, obviously. But um, I think uh, collectively, I think it was a, a lapse in concentration on two of the goals that we could fine tune. It was a tough game, you know, playing 75 minutes uh, down a man is tough. I mean, credit to Dallas. They were ever able to exploit uh, exploit us on, on a couple instances and they punished us. And we um, um, didn't get the result that we wanted. And and having 10 men on the field, how difficult is for the midfield to adapt to that situation? You know, the, uh, how, how was that work, was for you uh, personally? Yeah, it's tough. It's a lot of dirty running, uh, like we like we call it. Um, yeah, I mean, uh, it's just about just trying to stay compact, build pressure when we can, clog the middle, make us make them play around us. And uh, you saw that they had a, a lot of crosses um, coming from wide areas because they they were unable to penetrate down the middle. Um, but yeah, I mean, it wasn't wasn't an easy game, and um, you know, it was definitely tough going down to men for for most of the game. Thank you and safe travel. Thanks. Go ahead, Benjamin Bergen. Hi, Kellen. Uh, you mentioned the uh, lack of concentration, but do you feel like fatigue also played a role in the final minutes of the game? I mean, definitely. I think with a game like this, like going down to men most of the game, I mean, that's even more time to be concentrated. Um, on the little details and uh, yeah, you saw the tired legs um, and we lacked a little bit of concentration. It's a crucial part of the game and credit to Dallas for uh, capitalizing on that. And on a more uh, positive note, uh, what did you think of uh, Chiellini's pass to Arango in the first half? Yeah, it was a great ball. I mean, Chiellini and Giorgio showed his qualities. Uh, Chicho with a great finish and um, yeah, I mean, I think that was our, our our best moment in the game for sure. Um, but yeah, I think uh, overall, I think it was disappointing. Um, but uh, I'm proud of the boys for the effort. Um, like I said, it's not not Dallas is not a uh, um, not an easy team to play against, and um, it was uh, it was a tough game. And Kellen, just one last question here. Um, you just have two days to turn on turn things around and, and now you're heading to Minnesota. What is your mindset going into that? And how do you, you know, turn the tide and look for a win when you arrive there? Yeah, we just got to recover now. Obviously we have a sour taste in our mouths, not uh, getting a, a good result here. Um, but uh, that's the nature of the game. We play in a few days. Uh, uh, I think we travel tomorrow and now we just got to switch our focus, focus, uh, flush this game out of our system and um, look on to Minnesota. It's another game for us to, to get back on track, get some crucial points, especially being on the road. And uh, I got treated like a final. I mean, it's a final stretch of games. Um, you know, there's only two games until the international break. So this is uh, a block that we need to go into national break on a positive note. So I think it's a, an opportunity for us in Minnesota to, to get back on track. Mm -hmm. Great. Thank you very much, Kellen, for your time. Safe travels. Thanks.